Six years following their victory at Liang province, the young members of the Sun family had grown into powerful warriors. And now, Sun Xian entrusted these young tigers with the path towards forging a new era. Responsible for the family, Sun Tzu took word of his victory to Yuan Shu. However, Yuan Shu refused to elevate the accomplishments properly and simply let him languish beneath his command for five years. At this rate, the tiger's claws would simply glow dull beneath the leadership of Yuan Shu. Feel the apprehension, Sun Tzu decided to trade the imperial seal to Yuan Shu for his freedom. Yuan Shu readily agreed to his proposal, and Sun Tzu is finally ready to strike out of his own. First, in order to obtain the base operations, he was determined to capture Wu Jun, which is the land of his ancestor. Together with his close friend Zhou Yu, Sun Tzu welcomed the event of New Age of Destiny. Looking on, Sun Zhan and the veteran general Huang Gai offered the support to the young tiger. War of the, this pack of tigers was about to be heard throughout the regions of Wujun and Zhongdong. <clears throat> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Dynasty Warriors 8 on the PS4. Now, last battle, we defeated the very legendary and splendid Mont Chao and his cavalry yet again. And of course, saying save Dong Zhou's butt, so hopefully he's grateful. Well, if he is. Otherwise, I don't care. <laughs> Anywho, here we are in the second battle of Wu Story Mode Conquest of Wu Jun. So, we have Sun Jian Sun here, who's leading the clan now, Sun Tzu. Yes, we also have Huang Gai. Aka the Wu, Wu veteran general, along with Sun Tzu's close friend Zhou Yu, the handsome Zhou Yu, if you would. But, like I said before, I figured we would get to play Sun Jian again later in the story, so why not play him now in this battle, right? So, let's get on with it. Show his weapon set up. Imperial Tiger and Falcon Flash. Ooh, I hope this weapon setup is acceptable for the viewers. Other than that, let's go ahead and get the battle started. I shall lead my clan through these chaotic times. And you guys know the deal. Let's go talk to everybody at camp. Master Sun Tzu is the new head of the Sun family. We will continue to support him with all of our might. Have you heard about an officer named Tai Chu Tzu? He's a powerful warrior who serves Wu Yao. He's won the affection of everyone around him, but his master treats him coldly. I wonder why Master Sun Tzu treats everyone nicely. Soon family has long been served by officers such as Huang Gai, Chong Pu, and one of the one with the funny eyes. I'm sorry, I've forgotten his name. You mean Han Dong? Ah, oh, poor Han Dong. He wants to get noticed in the battlefield every time. Things were terrible under Yuan Shu. I was worried that Master Sun Tzu would waste away in his service. Yeah, well, I'm sure that seal is going to bite Yuan Shu in the butt someday. I'm sure of it. The enemy has not had time to fortify the defenses. It's a good thing we marched so quickly. You know, there's a certain art of reading the art of war. Right. If we win this battle... We can base our operations from here. How exciting! Oh, my daughter is here. Princess, where is Lord Sun Xian gone? 
My brother Chuan is off on other businesses now. He will rejoin us later on. Why do you ask, Leon Shi? You always seem to be worried about my brother. Uh, no. That's, that's not exactly the case. I can't take my eyes off of either of you, princess. For different reasons. At least, that's how I feel. What's with you, Yulan Shi? Don't make it sound like I'm in so much danger. My brother Tran and Han Dong will be arriving later. Until then, we have to do our ver do the best we can. I will risk my life to protect you, Princess. That is how I can repay the debt I owe the Sun family. Lady Lan Shi apparently comes from a family that was used to be very powerful. Must have been through a lot. The Sun family was impressed with their talents, and now she serves as the bodyguard for the princess. I wonder what kind of man the princess will marry. I can't think of any candidates for her at the moment. Well, maybe getting a little too ahead of ourselves for Shan Chiang there. Don't you, buddy? And you. They aren't the only ones impressed with their talents. But she protect me too. Sure you do, buddy. Sure you do think that way. I know that deep down there is someone special who Lady Lian Shi cares a great deal about. Yes, that person is Lord Sun Quan. He is lucky to adore such a strong woman. Wu belonged to the Sun family's great ancestor, Lord Sun Tzu. He even wrote his book, The Art of War, here. And now, hundreds of years later, we have Lord Sun Tzu. He is bound to be skilled in battle. What's up, Huan guy? We must conquer and retake Wu. This is surely our most pressing business. The Sun family's wind of changes will begin blowing here. Seems like everyone we talked to here at camp, so how about we go ahead and begin the battle by speaking to my son and his best friend. I'm sorry, Zhou Yu. Did not think we would end up in this position. Oh no, Sun Tzu. Actually, I'm rather pleased. Rather than taking over Sun Jian's base, you and I get to embark on the new quest for power. <laughs> Thanks. I know I can always rely on you. Okay. First we need to set up a base to start from. And that should be definitely be here in Wu. Yes. This lo land belongs to the Sun family. But right now is being held by others. Who defeat the usurpers and claim the this land for the Sun family? The people of Wu are sure to accept you with open arms. Yes, I know what must be done. Now, we just need to go and do it. Chuan and Han Dong should be here t soon too. So, let's begin our fight. So the enemy forces in Wanling Castle refuse to come out and fight us today. Then we must capture their bases and shoot them up again. I will join you. Nonsense, my lord. You have more important things to do than a company of old men. Though I'm getting up there in years myself, you Besides, I'm leaving command of the front line to my son. <laughs> in that case, I would be happy to have you join us. Okay. Well, already, here's your basic combo. I'll show the other moves. That's your charge two, charge one, which kind of slows it down a little bit. Oh, oh yikes! There's the switch attack. The enemy has arrived. If only Master Tai Shu Tzu was here now. I have heard talk that Tai Shu Tzu is a most good general. 
Why does Liu Yao refuse to send him to battle? Come on, what are you waiting for? Let's get this fight started. Is your first new cell? I'll let you go for now. Don't think you won. Fear the tiger, young dog. Charge forward with the second EX attack. And move on and proceed to the East Fort here. Part 5. Part 3 with the first EX. Quite a spectacle. Truly amazing. What are you doing here? You're not taking this place on my watch. Come on, Joshin. There you go. That's the switch counter. Get your air moose out here. One of my favorite air moose cells in the game, actually. Now we have to find a way to get behind the enemy main camp. Oh, I'm starving. Master Sun Tzu has grown into a magnificent soul. Everyone is mother to just see. This is my duty to ride with this. Indeed, I am ready to put my life on the line. Help him realize his goal. You are unstoppable. Such errantry was destined to lead Wu. There's you your charge are six. Simply amazing. Try it again. <laughs> We've got you cornered. Thanks, one guy, for seeing my kill. I cannot stand to sit back and watch the enemy any longer. It pains me to betray you, Master Liu. But I must go out and. Fight! Ooh, I ordered him to wait. He tried to embarrass me. We're trapped. We'll have to take down the enemy troops, then find a means of escape. I'm sorry. I surrender. He's planning to retake the supply depot. We've got to stop him before he can accomplish his mission. That was quite a As you can tell, a few minutes later, or not later, earlier, that was Xinjiang's second missile that I used to defeat Yan Bai Fu and Dong Chi. Alright, let's go deal with Tai Chi Su here. Oh, yikes. I missed that. Let's try that again. There you go. Tice your shirt with Storm. Retreat and rethink my strategy. Not only did Taisha Sir contravene my orders, but he got himself defeated as well. If only he'd waited as I told him to. Brother, I am sorry to have kept you waiting. However, I am here now to fight by your side. Fear the tiger, Jiang Dong. How blessed I am to be able to witness my son's development with my very own eyes. Go, son! The next age is yours for the making. I'm so hungry. I can't go any further.
feel like I should apologize, you know, that will make it to necessary. For Sun Jian's constant ringing bell sounds every time he attacks. And again, this is the nine minutes played. Is there anybody else here but who's he wrong? It's gotta be. Ah, is your lead. Okay, let's group all these guys together for a rage moose attack. Very badass way from myself. I'm so enjoying if I do say so myself. Unfortunately, we didn't get the cinematic camera angle at the end there. Because there was an obstacle in the way. Alright, let's get a move on. Also, you're listening to Good Good Punch. This is today's battle track. Hold that up with this. Oh, not bad. Excellent. That's the father I've always looked up to. Proceed to the uh, southwest port here. I want to show that rage we saw again. So we get that to the man camera going at the end. He's me, me. He's understanding. Let's do this for the viewers. That's what I like to see. For sure, one of my favorite Rage Moon styles in the game. wondering what I was doing right there. I was doing a weapon switch with the charge jump and follows up with the shadow sprint. Just like South Sound Shuffle Dune, King John's Mother Spirit combo. Let's get T here. Alright, let's get. Perfect timing. I was looking for an opportunity to test my new tactics. Tiger of That's excellent fighting. Fear the tiger of Dong. So canonically, Sun John would not be in this battle. Thank goodness he didn't win the very first battle of the story. 
be honest with you, Xinjiang is like one of my favorite warlords in these three games. Again, touch yourself. You've got spirit, Taishu. I'll give you that. I think you'd be better served by fighting on behalf of my son. I am currently in the service of Master Ryu Yao. Betraying him is more than I can bear. Do you intend to spend the rest of your days protecting Liu Yao? It would be such a waste of your talent. You mean my talents are being wasted here? This is how the time hunts. All of us up with this? I sure can. Oh yikes. Defeat and withdraw. Maybe someday we can fight on the same side. The gates are open. Head straight for their leader. Fear the tiger of Jung Dong. I refuse to hand over the flag to the mighty few. Prepare to meet your end. This land originally belonged to us. I am simply taking it back, Liu Yao. Enough with your nonsense, Liu Yao. This land belongs to our ancestors. We are here to wrest it back from your grasp. Excellent. That's the father I've always looked up to. <laughs> Yikes, one guy. Keep on pushing Liu Yao away. I'm trying to hit him. Fear the tiger of Jiang Dong. Done it, my lord. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. Master Liu Yao, my apologies. As a warrior and as a man. I wish to live a just and true life. So, from this day, my life is yours, Master Sun Tzu. <laughs> Thank you, Tai Shi Tzu. Look, my lord. This is your land. And these are your men. Yes. I finally feel it. I stand as the head of the House of Sun. The land is in turmoil. To be honest, I've no idea what'll happen next. But, with your help, I'm going to do everything I can to make it right. Let's go. The House of Wu stands proudly in Jiangdong, and we are its people. Yeah. Yeah. The glory of Wu. Anywho, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be all for today's episode of Dynasty Warriors 8. Please like and comment of what do you think of the conquest of Wu Jun. And if you would like to stay tuned for upcoming episodes of Dynasty Warriors 8, I suggest 
subscribing to my channel. Until then, ladies and gentlemen, have a nice day and take care. See you later, and GG.